do you want to make your own Busy Pussy High Diving Safe? In this video, I'll share with you a simple drill that will help you improve the power and explosiveness needed to jump higher and run faster. Coming up! Hi there, Master Gallia Claudia Kowalska here, bringing you the best tips and strategies for goalkeeping training. On this channel, you can find a lot of training ideas, coaching strategies, as well as a lot of pre game preparation tips and even goalkeeping psychology. So, definitely subscribe if you're new here so you don't miss out on any new content. In today's video, I'm going to talk about uh, power and explosiveness and why we need it and how can we develop it. Uh, but first, we need to understand that the demands for a goalkeeper are completely different to an outfield player. And the focus should be on improving those areas that are most important and utilised in the game. And for you, for a goalkeeper, it's power. Most goalkeepers have physical differences that can prevent them from reaching their peak performance. And I remember when I was younger, um, when I did make a decision, <clears throat> it was a very quick decision, and I did react to to this situation. But I was still unable to get that ball and get, and make a save. Um, so let me know, let me know in the comments below if that ever happened to you when you react to the situation and it was a good decision that you've made but you still haven't been able to, to make that save. And this is because your body has to be physically able to go there to, to make that save. So in order to succeed, you need strength and conditioning training and not just a skill-based training. However, you can't just do it sporadically. You can't just do it here and there. You must be committed to it and you must include strength and conditioning into your training on a regular basis. That's very important. So now I'd like you to understand how the muscles work. Uh, and there are three phases in an explosive movement. So first your muscle gets longer. Okay. Then uh, we have a slight delay. It pauses for a split second and then your muscle shortens and contracts so then the desired movement uh, takes place. As a goalkeeper you have to be the quickest player on the field to be honest. You, you, you are the quickest, you must be the quickest um, to twist your core or um, drive your hands out to make a save so you must train your body in an explosive manner. So now I'd like to show you a, a quick drill that you can add to your training that will help you with developing power. Let's have a look. So as you can see that it's very simple drill and you can really adapt it very easily. So if you want to work more on jumping and collecting the ball at the highest point, here is a very cool adaptation for this, uh, for this drill.
much for checking out this video. I hope you've enjoyed it and if you got a value out of it, hit that like button, share with your friends if you feel they will benefit from that as well. And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. There is a lot more content coming your way, so definitely you want to stay tuned. Uh, also, let me know in the comments below if there is anything uh, you need help with, if there's anything you'd like me to cover in the future videos. I will be checking those out, uh, so definitely comment below. Train hard and I'll see you soon.